Colossians 3.23 says, Whatever you do, work at it with all your heart, as working for the Lord, not for man. Everything we do here at Prestonwood Christian Academy is done with an eternal mindset, a focus on God's will and purpose for our lives. We want to share with you a special story of a family in the lower school at our Plano campus. Because of the eternal perspective of our school system, this family's entire life story changed forever. Hi, I'm Donna Bhattacharya, and I am a new parent of PCA. My son just started PCA this year. He's a student of pre-K-4 in Miss Armstrong class. My background, I have been raised in a strong Hindu family, which is a very um, religious family. Like, we have always been strong by our faith. So my dad used to perform all the rituals. So I have been uh, raised in a Christian school, like partly in my childhood, and I really like the way like they bring up their kids and uh, they, they teach all the etiquettes, manners, their way of teaching, the basically the way they are so polite and uh, the way they will, like tell you to help others, to love others. So that is something which really attracts me towards any Christian school. So since I has been, I was being raised up in a Christian school, I just wanted that same for my son. When I took the tour in this uh, PCA, she kind of told me one thing that uh, we need to have a testimony and the recommendation from the pastor. So I was like, okay, so I don't know what a testimony is. Like, can you please tell me what is a testimony? So then I um, called up my local church. I was like, you know what, I have been attending your church just for the Easter services and Christmas things. So can you please give me your testimony and pastor recommendation? So she was like, okay, so testimony is not something you get in on paper. It's basically like, you know, you need to come to the church, like read some of the verses and then you have to basically accept Christ. So then I was like, okay, so that means am I going to like be from a Hindu background to a Christian, so that's what it was it means. So she was like, yes. So then I was like, okay, fine. So then she asked me like few questions. Do you believe in Jesus? I said, yes. Then because then she asked me the same things. How do you have your belief? And also I told it's but because of my schooling, I have been always been hearing these sermons kind of things and then hymns and songs, everything. So that's how I just, then I went ahead to my church and then I accepted Lord as my savior went home and told my husband and he also accepted uh, Christ as a savior and then we finally got baptized on uh, April 28th this year. My son, he's like very much loving the church. He always like waits to for the Sundays, you know, to go and then even the school, he, he learns a lot. Like one day he just came and told me, Jesus loves me. And you know, those little things which like, I think they are doing a good job in planting the seeds of that little religious thing, you know, because that's what it's actually keeps you going is your faith. 